Boardwalk Carnival at Canal Side still going on today, an event that has attracted thousands of people downtown this holiday weekend, scorching heat and all. Although some violence did erupt at the carnival late Saturday. Buffalo police say 17-year-old Jaquan Wilson Buffalo was arrested and charged with criminal possession of a weapon and unlawful possession of marijuana after a fight broke out near that carnival area. And tonight, the group in charge of the popular waterfront site is taking action. 7 Eyewitness News reporter Matt Bovey went to the waterfront today and has more. Do you feel safe? I do now, yeah. Tom Sharpa says he never would have brought his grandson Mason to Canal Side if he didn't feel safe. He, like many we talked to, knew about the fight and the arrest that happened over the weekend, but most didn't seem to mind. Do you have any concerns bringing the, the sun No, out? not this early. You know, we probably won't stay around when it gets later at night. Um, but, you know, during the day it seems to be mostly families. We asked Erie Canal Harbor Development, the group in charge of Canal Side, what they were doing in response. Now, they believe the fight was an isolated incident, but they're ramping up security something people today surely noticed. I've seen a lot of security around. There's a pretty good, de uh, pretty good deal of security guards here. I see it being nice and safe. There should be no problems at all. Everywhere I look, I see security and plenty of police officers. And for a little perspective, I actually talked to a security guard and asked just how many people are responsible for the canal side area. He said at any given time, they have 15 to 20 security officers out watching the grounds. At Canal Side, Mapo Bay, 7 Eyewitness News.